the prayers of the people. Grant that every member of the church may truly and humbly serve you, that the life of Christ may be revealed in us. We rem remember those who have died, especially Linda, and all those who have died from the coronavirus. Father, into your hands we commend them. We praise you for all your saints who have entered your eternal glory. May we also come to share your heavenly kingdom. Have compassion on those who suffer from sickness, grief, or trouble, especially Amity, Stephen, Jim, Martha, Betty and Peter, Anne, Angela and John, Terry, Liza and Alice, Derek, Anita, Greg, Sarah Elizabeth, Edwin and Dorothy, Donna and Danny, Kate, Alan, Ginny, David, Joanne, Simon, Maureen, Felicia, Janice, Robert, Ralph, and Alexandra. In your presence, may they find strength. Look with your kindness on our homes and our families. Grant that your love may grow in our hearts. We give you thanks for our blessings, for the baptism of Martha. Make us alive to the needs of our community. Let us pray for all who are suffering because of the racial injustices of the past and present. We pray for the men and women in the police department, and we pray for those who protest peacefully. Help us to share one another's joys and burdens. Inspire and lead those who hold authority in the nations of the world. Guide us and all people in the way of justice and peace. Strengthen all who minister in Christ's name. Give us courage to proclaim the gospel. God, our hope, may your blessing empower our thanksgivings and our prayer. For we put our trust in you, the living God, risking disappointment, risking failure, working and waiting expectantly. Amen.